New at 5 complaints launched today against Shasta County's election office and its clerk. Action News Now reporter Taylor Helms is live outside the county supervisor's chambers where the Shasta County Citizens Election Advisory Committee uh, Commission met earlier. So, Taylor, what happened? Right, so a lot of time was spent on the very first item on the regular agenda, over an hour at least, talking about an elect about election findings that one man named Richard Gallardo submitted to the committee. Uh, it's right here, there's over two dozen pages included in here making claims of violations, uh, make dozens of pages requesting surveillance video from the elections office on Market Street, as well as claims of violations of envelope processing, video monitoring of elections, observing elections. The committee voted today to have members Don Duckett and Chair uh, Coney and Lund, Roney and Lund, excuse me, to be on an ad hoc committee to go over all of Gallardo's claims and Public Records Act's requests he's already submitted relating to the elections office and the registrar of voters, Kathy Darling Allen. Those two committee members would present what they find to the Shasta County Board of Supervisors. I just want to remind this commission that, you know, you're here to look for fair and transparent elections. You're here to uh, accept comments, complaints, questions regarding the elections office and everything occurring there. And that's exactly what my grievances are about. Committee members Suzanne Barrymore and Don Duckett agreed that most of what Gallardo is asking for is something that the Attorney General's office would have to deal with rather than the committee or the Board of Supervisors here in Shasta County. Live in Reading, Taylor Helms, Action News Now, coverage you can count on. Taylor, the next scheduled meeting for the Citizens Election Committee is in two weeks, December 18th.